Oh, Moody. Babies, are you? I lose Kenisha Moody and Kenrick Moody. How that them from them body in Goshen in St. Elizabeth by scamming people money and then find them body in two, two small graves. I need to find out where them body there. Come here, them father. I need to get to them. I've been calling them mother Stephanie Edwards and she won't answer her phone. And me heard it from Saturday evening till yesterday Sunday. And told to them I heard what I go on. I'm desperate if you know if I them fit you. Kenisha Moody and Kenrick Moody. Blessed evening to my viewers and my subscribers. Them. Me hope everybody having a blessed and a wonderful evening. Now my viewers and my subscribers, remember, in everything you do, always put God first. In every and uh, any situation, just always remember for call upon God. Always remember for pray because a prayer day keep the devil away. Now my viewers and my subscribers, the father of the two person, the brother and the sister that get murdered over there in Westmoreland and buried at the shallow grave, speak out people. Also, Andre Stevens discussed the topic and break it down to the people them. Also, Andre Stevens Rush Andrew Wallace with his eighth speech and talk about SSL and all of them something there. So people, you definitely don't want to miss this one. But before we get into this one, people, I would appreciate if you all would leave a like on this video. Please give this video a thumbs up. Also, if you're a new viewer's first time on my channel, then please subscribe to my channel and turn on the post notification bell. So whenever we drop new content, you will be first to be notified. Share the content and leave your opinion down below in the comment section. People, we are getting to the video, but we soon come. Make a run intro and come back. Now, dance all royalty review TV. Drop the bad review, them no man. You know, see how you always drop the bad review, them you know. People, remember to subscribe and like. People, remember to subscribe. Have you seen the news of the two? The brother and the sister who was killed and placed in the shallow grave. Have you seen the news? Let me show you them picture. See them there? Brother and sister, I think one is 21 and the next one is 20. In West Milan. See the private number they are called me students and I annoy me. The brother and the sister in a shallow grave. 20 and 22 years old. They are called the Moody's. They are called the Moody's. Jamaica, Jamaica not safe. Jamaica not safe. It's alleged to have been. They are involved in scamming. But what I am saying, Jamaica is Jamaica is not safe. Mm -hmm. Jamaica is not safe. It's a very unsafe space. And no matter how much tourism, no matter how much pretty, pretty, no matter how much this or that, when you see the video, Jesus, I owe my black private number from calling me. No, sir. Yes, my peeps. Man, I send voice note to him murder them people there. Yeah. Listen to what I'm saying, you know, peeps. You don't know, you know, it's a crazy world, you know. Jamaica got mad, you know. Mad things are going on. I like that father, bad man. I like that a whole area league and things to bury the medal till I two of them are you know. Curry, like, curry, the soldier, curry, and done, man. You see, peace, a chick, black, a work, you know. Kaki, color, hungry, one, really. Kaki, color, hungry, a work, you know. Yes, man, that's a 50, man. You see, chop them chop a man from the dog and go around the dog, you see. 
So you come on in the supper, you go for the yard, but we don't get any key and don't know them ladies, you see me? Food here, the yard, they don't tell you the information every fucking thing already. Everything there, the yard, so you bury them and all in after the yard, you will get the money up at the yard. And then after now, we're in the night, I'm not going to place that this party, you see me? Take up the money up at the yard, and then when them done, them are going to leave the place, because the place is hot. What a, what a thing happening in Jamaica? What a thing happening in Jamaica? What a thing happening in Jamaica? Jamaica come in like a very unsafe place. You never know the time, the hour, the second that somebody else will be a casualty. Only hear the voice note. Only want me play the voice note again. Only want me play the voice note again. Me go play it again. Yes, my peeps. Man, I send voice note to a murder them people there. Yeah. Listen to what I'm saying, you know, peeps. You don't know, you know. It's a crazy world, you know. Jamaica got mad, you know. Mad things are going on. I hate that father bad, man. I hate that whole illegal thing for bury them. I don't tell you. I told them I don't hate, you know. Prosper in peace. How that them found them body in Goshen in St. Elizabeth by scamming people money and then find them body in two, two small graves. I need to find out where them body there. Come here, them father. We need to get to them. I've been calling them mother Stephanie Edwards and she won't answer her phone. And me heard it from Saturday evening till yesterday Sunday. And till today me I heard the war go on. Me desperate if you know if I them fit you. Kenisha Moody and Kenrick Moody. Kenisha Moody and Kenrick Moody. This are the father say, him ears are scamming cause them to lose them life. And him a try get to the mother. What a banger and a go on in a Jamaica. So if you scam, are you do them something that I lose you, you go lose your life? Look, 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 look how the private number still are called. Mm. <sighs> That's private number something that distract me as much as possible. Anybody want to call in and contribute to this discussion? Only hear what the father say? A scamming. It no worth. It no worth. Nothing for you to lose your life because of scamming. Oh, you're going to settings. Me no know no about phone, you know. Oh, you're going to settings and delete and, and black. No, something number. Oh, you're going to settings and black the number. Unknown number.
Yes, Miss Winnie. Yes, my darling. How are you, sweet pie? I am good. You like my outfit tonight? No, anything you put on looks so dappy. Yeah? Mm -hmm. You look sweet. Anyway, look about um, scamming. It's the worst thing you can do to people is to scam their money. And the person that give you the information, you're going to work with them. Do not take their money. Give them the money you collect from the Western Union or MoneyGram. Let them give you what you're supposed to get. Mm -hmm. Because man don't play with their money. They, they take people money and they don't care. And then you go and take the money. Mm -mm. I'm sorry that they lost their life. And I wish they could tell the family where they buried them. Mm -hmm. You know? But all I can say, do not take any notice of the... um of the black cat that calling you you understand just ignore them you understand you listening yes mama don't take notes it's, it's a black cat that set them up to call you don't worry anyway you take care and uh, i will sing for you on christmas day you'll sing for me on christmas day <laughs> yes i'm gonna learn how to sing but i'm gonna warn the audience when i start singing they must run. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Winnie said when she has sing on Christmas, they don't have to run left far. All right, Miss Winnie, God bless you. Okay. I love you so much. I love you. And say hello to Miss Claudette for me and the team, okay? All right, Miss Winnie, God bless you. The number to call is 995-5301. We free the scamming thing are going bad. Brother and sister. Rough, 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 rough. All the fat scamming on the Kuneva, me not know if we need to kill them. I saw man life work none these days. I saw man life work none these days. 22 and 20. 22 and 20. I saw people life work none these days. Just for little scamming money. No, sir. That's why I'm glad I sit down for my own and sell my cake. Sell my pig steel, Sell my pasta. So all me are the students. Me not scam nobody. Me not want to get no, no story about no scamming. And so that's why I keep to myself. And do my little business. Uno rang me. Uno rang me. Look what scamming cast them. Look what scamming cast them. Good, good 20 year old and 22 year old for them say. Esther, do I? If you have a problem with me being all over the place, you don't have to watch my platform. If you have a problem with me being all over the place, you don't have to watch my platform. Get off my platform. So I want to come over here and think so they can abuse me every night. Me not take no more abuse. Get off my platform, man. You're too out of order. You're too out of order. Very rude and out of order. You're very rude and out of order. You have the option to leave my platform. Don't come over here and want to dictate to people. Leave now. Go all over the place. Me, I make sure me sell my things them. And me still I educate the students them. People like you suffer from attention deficit disorder. Only don't know if you keep focus. When you come over here, I want to tell people how to run them platform. All I am saying is, if you never listen to the line of argument, let me give you the line of argument. I am not going to entertain scamming. It is alleged that both of them lose their life to scamming. I said Esther Dwyer. 
That is why I'm not getting into scamming. Me I sell my pig tail and sell my arm. How me move off a how me move off a chain? How me come off a topic? Are you you Esther the wire? You come off a topic. You come off a topic. Only love come, come, come style people and come disrespect people. Social media now gonna disrespect me. Only do too much height already. So the little pride and dignity we may have left. Me go make sure. Me rain in some on and now come over here and abuse me every night. Rude. Misery surely loves company and you now get me if you come up. You see I'm nice and clean and comfortable tonight. As a matter of fact, as a matter of fact, the church is asking the prime minister to explain what he mean by eight speech. When I hear the prime minister say, "Mama, class for eight speech," what is eight speech? What is eight speech? Let me give you the definition of hate speech. May I go according to Google? Abusive or threatening speech or writing that expresses prejudice on the basis of ethnicity, religion, sexual orientation, or similar grounds. We do not tolerate any form of hate speech. What kind of laws is the Prime Minister putting in place for hate speech? Who is the Prime Minister dictating to say that hate is being thrown at them? Is the minority community? Is it religious groups? Who is the Prime Minister talking about when he says want to put in laws for hate speech? Or is this another way of trying to control freedom of expression and freedom of speech in Jamaica? Or is this a case where the Prime Minister is doing what he does best, being a dictator at best? What is it he mean by hate speech? I want to ask only tonight. What does the Prime Minister mean by hate speech? The church group is asking, Uno no one know to. I look like him want to find ways to shut down social media. Shut down everybody from expressing themselves when it comes on to him. Hmm? So if anybody wants to reason with me tonight and tell me about hate speech and what the Prime Minister mean by it. Only can tell me what I think when the Prime Minister want to do. I the Prime Minister. My Prime Minister is me and Matley. I soon go live a Barbados. Hate speech. Abusive or threatening speech or writing that expresses prejudice on the basis of ethnicity. Religion, sexual orientation, or similar grounds. Wow. According to the United Nations, hate speech is discriminatory, biased, bigoted, or intolerant. Or prejudice, contemptuous, or de demeaning of an individual or group. Let me go on this one. In common language, hate speech refers to offensive discourse targeting a group or an individual based on inherent characteristics such as religion and gender. 
and that may threaten social peace. To provide a unified framework for the United Nations to address the issue of globe globally, the UN Secretary UN Strategy and Plan of Action on Hate Speech defines hate speech as any kind of communication in speech, writing, or behavior that attacks or uses provoc pejorative or discriminatory language with reference to a person or a group on the basis of who they are. In other words, based on their religion, based on their ethnicity, based on their nationality, their race, their color, their descent, their gender, and other identity factor. However, today, there is no universal definition of hate speech under international human rights law. The concept is still under discussion, especially in relations to freedom of opinion and expression, non-discrimination, and equality. Mm. So, Jamaica, the Prime Minister say he wants to put laws in place for hate speech. What defines hate speech is a very good question because across the world, nobody can come up with a definition and globally to say that this is hate speech and there's no law like that really across the globe for hate speech. But the Prime Minister wants to like you know he wants to cut down on social media now he's going after hate speech so your prime minister jamaica wants to do that anybody wants to call and give their contribution to this discussion remember remember i'm styling ham for christmas you can come to me and get your hams done for the christmas i'm styling hams for christmas what do you think the Prime Minister means by hate speech? Do you believe that bloggers will be targeted under the hate speech law? Do you believe that freedom of expression is being undermined? These are questions that need to be answered. And your Prime Minister seemingly don't want to answer these questions. And they must be answered. The church group is asking for answers. Will other groups ask for answers? It's something to and it's something that we must get an answer to. Anybody wants to talk tonight? I am here. And on the topic of SSL. You see those Laptops that were stolen. We know that critical information is on those laptops. And Tom, drunk but Tom no fool. We know say all of the information wiped from them laptop there. And from the inception, those laptops should have been in police custody. Those laptops should not be at SSL. You understand? Those laptops at SSL that went missing. Mm -hmm. We know critical information is on those laptops. And those laptops from day one should have never been, should have never been in the care of SSL's office. They should have been in police custody. But because they did have them plan a long time. Because they had all their plans a long time. Those laptops just. It's wrong. It's very wrong. I see SSL. Nothing is going to come out of SSL. Nothing coming out of SSL. It will be fading like the wind. It will go fade like the wind. Is it like how Christmas come in and Christmas go out or once per year? It says it'll just mention January and it gone again. Not no more now come out tight. And these men will get the chance. These men will get the chance to operate business in Jamaica again. 